as we decide the titles, the 2023 WSK Supermaster Series. There are other cards to the left of your screen, Kostoya, and to the right, the Belgium for VDK Racing, T-Board Amakers. We race for the 2023 WSK Supermaster Series title. David Cosmore, Christopher slots up into second place. We're we'll get watching for the golden helmet of Filippo Sala. The Italian there, Sassotti card on the inside. You know the championship contender is right behind him in the form of Stefan Antonov. Behind Scott Lindblom in the Tony cart, who's now been passed by the Belgian. Tibor Rummick is down the inside. And the Card Republics goes second and third. It's the Parolin off Costoya who's got the race lead. The Spaniard, if he wins the race, if Antonov and Salah stay back, he would take the title. Still a long way to go. He's about to complete the second lap. As we see, Thibaut Ramakers, the Belgian, the fastest qualifier, over into second place. Costoya, now from the Belgian. Look at Zach on the attack. The Glaswegian down the inside. Nicely done by Drummond. The two-time British mini champion goes up into third place. Sala follows him through. Sala can take the title as well. That's an opportunity for the Belgian to go by the Spaniard. That's a better one. Timor up the inside. Goes wheel to wheel. Costoya in the grass. Almost. Super start from Filippo Sala, who moves up into third place. The Belgian lead, the Spaniard second, and the driver from the very north of Italy up into third place. We're watching from Stappen Antonov as well. Costoya has got the race lead just from Ranakers. And Costoya, 232, he loses another position, and he loses points in the title chase as well. Ramakers goes up into the lead. Antonov would take the title. As we move into the second half of the race, there is the Russian 3-1-0 for the Card Republic team. David Kostman, Christopher, the Romanian right behind. He took pole position on Friday. Seconds. Pastoria under attack from Antonov. He may not know. He does not need to get by onto the podium to take the title. He's done so anyhow. Pastoria's in trouble. David Cosmo Christopher. DCC goes on three. Goes wheel to wheel. Pastoria tries to defend, but the Spaniards off the road into the grass. He's been belted. Lewis goes on by Pastoria will not win the WSK Supermaster Series for 2023. He's out of it. The final few corners. A brilliant performance from Tibor Ramakas. As Sala loses another position, he's off the podium. That checkered flag is about to wave. The Belgian Tibor Ramakas wins the race with the new champion for 2023. The Cup Republic, Stepan Antonov. The new champion for 2023. And we're ready to race the 10 lap mini under 10 final. Legenki to the left of your screen, the WSK Champions Cup champion. This is the rebuilt Cremona circuit, 1,210 metres. Kurski to the right. Up to the line and we race for the title. Down into turn one, perfect start from Legenki as predicted. The Queenslander follows the Ukrainian through, but he leaves the door open. Albert Tarr for Team Baby Race is right there, as is Leo Gorski. And they go up the inside and take the Australian. He's not even inside the top 15. As the Baby Race driver goes on through to take the lead. Nicely done by Nicky Kutzkoff. 
So the Russian leads the Ukrainian. The Australian in position three. And you know this with Terry Orlando, Sebastian Sensett. The Australian in position one and says, this race is mine, boys. He goes by and takes the lead. Legenki up into second place and that allows Sebastian to pull away ever so slightly. Orlando in the background. Look at that, the baby race drivers, Kutskov and Gorski. And the Russian fighting to try and get by the Ukrainian who himself slips up the inside of the Australian. Sebastian back to P3. The Queenslander. Now fighting off the pole, Leo Gorski. Behind its top, Nikolo Perikov in the energy cut has made a super start in P6. We can't give the Ukrainian for the Venetian team on Devon Taluki team driver. And he could score back in P1. Lukinki gets him back on the exit on a corner where you cannot pass. It's going to cost them all time. This is getting messy. Lukinki's got the race lead just. For Kutzkoff. Up right now. Kutzkoff up the inside. Sebastian tries to follow through. Legeki pulls out under brakes. They skate. They're trading positions. Gorski takes this Gandhi. And Legeki goes by Kutzkoff. That's the door heading in the background. The son of World Rally Championship racer Alessandro, who is watching on his boy car through the field. The Russian and the Ukrainian, they work together in a significant moment for world peace here and world motorsports. What a race here at Pomona. Lukinki has to hold on, not into the left-hander, but the double right coming up right now. Korski hits the back of Eskandani. The Australian's out of it. Alexander Lekinki wins! The WSK Champions Cup champion accelerates out of the final corner. What a race, what a drive. Lekinki wins here at Cremona. Good got to Pedico. Nicolo Pedico has taken the podium. Alexander Lekinki is the WSK Super Masters Series champion for 2023. <laughs> Noel Baglin. That is the English driver to the bottom left of your screen. He'll be starting on pole for position in just a moment. 36 cuts on the grid. <music> Dean the Dutchman, Dean Hugendorn, P3 in the previous round of the championship, which was won by Jean-Matteo Rousseau. goes out before the start. Baglin leads and Billy C goes through in position two. Behind him is Dean Hugendorn. As Billy C down the inside and he's going to follow him on through. Team Baby Rice in first and second place. Baglin back to third. Hugendorn is now in traffic. He will not win the championship. They go down the back straight. Noah has a long, hard look behind. There is Ivy Christian, the Vortex Power Tony Cut. Of the Canadian in position five. There's the championship confirmation. Bottom right of your screen. Sulfi Cardi would take the title. Even if his teammate Kalita wins the race. Which he may well do as we move into the second half here at Cremona. This magnificent circuit. South of Milan. The gap, 0 0.4 of a second. Miley Christian still behind the Romanian, the fastest qualifier. That's Bogdan in P4. Via Piana, Ivan Inkov, Dean the Dutchman, P8. Second in the championship only. 
with eighth in the race here this afternoon. Last lap, the gap is six tenths of a second. Zulfi Kani, P2, would take the title. If the knee off, he's in P7 ahead of Hugenton. This is the battle for four and five. Eileen Christian, the Canadian, in the vortex power, Tony can't be the fastest qualifier. Fox and Cross for Christopher. <laughs> cheering on after midnight back in Melbourne, Australia. Aussie, 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 oi, oi, oi. William Kalita wins finally in WSK. Zulfi Kadi crosses the line in B2. And with that, the driver from Istanbul is the WSK Super Master Series champion for 2023. From Istanbul in Turkey for Team Baby Race, this is the WSK Super Master Series champion, Iskander. Sufi Kadi! The championship decider here at Kodamona. The carts are on the circuit. Still a few moments before the start of the KZ2 final. Emilian in one, two, one. Senna in one, two, two. Yevon the bat in one, two, four. The Sri Lankan on the second row of the grid. Red flag, the five red lights. We race. Perfect start from Tenna. And Senna shadows him. Tell me inside. Bertuka gets aggressive with the Sri Lanka. We've got a monster multi car pile up at the exit of turn two. It has eliminated one of the Tony Kart drivers and two Beryl Arts. A robber is out. Alessio Piccini was also caught up in that. He's managed to restart, but he's way down at the back of the field. Jean Louis has also been caught up in that second corner accident. And the Swiss driver. In the 1 1 2, Tony Kart is out. Dinner across the line. Senna tries to cover off Figanol. E. Berger Masco tolerates none of it. Genie has managed to keep going. There is Palomba walking back to the pits. He's out. Jean Louis is also out. A sensational start to the KZ2 final. The championship decider. Bertuka in position three. Do not be surprised if Matteo Vigano gets the word from Pit Lane. You know the famous line, Fernando is faster than you, the sister team. Matteo Vigano with Bertuka right behind him. He will not fight Bertuka, I promise you that. And they've already dropped off the reigning champion, Senator Van Walsign, Kevin David. Dinner will not be intimidated by one of the hardest drivers in the world, but it matters not. Vigano up the inside, Denner tries to fight back. Martel for the Lennox Racing Team goes through to lead, looks over his shoulder and says, cop that to a million. Bertuka's right there. Denner in the middle of a Lisson S sandwich. Freddie Slater, P8. Maxim Rem and Carol Pachevich the pole in the Sicilian Lento cart. Powered by the LKE, rounds out the 10. Big and all. Three tenths of a second, make that four tenths of a second as they come across the line. Bertuka needs to be so careful here. He won the WSK Champions Cup to start the 2023 season. Viganol, the fastest driver on the circuit, actually puts himself into contention. A race win here this afternoon would see him take third in the title. The Italian veteran from the French star, and then Christian Cannibal. There's Tom Louye now having to defend from the Romanian. Daniel Vassilet 
the final quarter of the final round of the WSK Supermaster Series for 2023. It's out to seven tenths of a second. A center down the inside. Here's Yevon David. Nice move from the Sri Lankan. Down the inside, can't hit it around the circuit. Pacini has also retired. Winning the championship, he will win the final round of the WSK Super Master Series with a stunning drive here at Cremona. Dinner across the line in P2. Verduga, third place in the race. Welcome to the top step of the podium, the new WSK Supermaster Series champion for Team Pirolat, Christian Kamibaldertuka! Final with the Belgian to start in the Erste Posisi. Thomas Strauban will be where Sam Budler, the Cup Republic, will lock out the front row of the grid. But it is James Zagotzi in the Tony Kart who is the championship leader. We race. Sam Budler darts across from the outside of the front row of the grid as the Cup Republics are split. Great start from the Tony Kart as the field muscle their way down through the first two corners. Super start from little Louis Iglesias. The CRG driver, we know his uncle Jeremy is like a jet off the start. He's taught his nephew well. Louis Iglesias shoots up into second place. James on the back of Louis This ferocious battle between the Tony Kart and Kart Republic teams. Agotzi, the American, he won the first round of the championship at Lonato. He made his debut in the Italian F4 Championship at the Imola Formula 1 Grand Prix circuit seven days ago and he just drives up the inside of the South African. <laughs> 239 CRG, you just saw that was Simone Bianco's car. Second DNF in the championship. As Agazzi and Sam Budler work together and Iglesias is now off the podium. Has to respond, little Louis from the French FFSA Championship. Less experienced, his uncle is Jeremy Iglesias, the 2020 World Champion. Artur Poulain, the Vortex is a quick, he's done 129 k's an hour. As a got, he makes a slight mistake, he knows it. The American can't throw it away. He's got an enormous lead in the championship, but he's only got a few centimetres between himself and the South African Sam Pupa, who's now been caught by New Iglesias, who's now starting to fight back. Makes and tie up into P5. Watch the bridge on the back of the young Frenchman. Sebastiano Pufan dives down the inside. He goes by Nathan Ty. the podium but he can hold his head up high as will be where down the inside James lets him go through does not need to fight but he will will be where slow on the exit look at Sebastiano in the background the fun is flying Thomas is gone James has a look behind somewhat of a relief as he sees it is a green card and lets him on through does not fight his teammate Sebastiano he's on the podium raising acknowledgement the Italian to his American teammate. No problem for Agotti, he'll stay, still take the title. The checkered flag is about to wave. Here at Cremona, the Belgian wins. His South African teammate across the line, Sam Woodler second, Buffon third, the American is the 2023 WSK Supermaster Series champion. Thank you.